So we're going to be looking at Eververse. This is the last week you can get some of this stuff from Eververse. Uh, Bungie put some of this in because it was supposed to be in, I think, last week or something like that. But just be aware of that. So let's get into it. First, we're going to be looking at the Regal Daring. If you do not have this shader yet, pick it up. It's a really good shader. I really, really like this shader. For the Transmet effect, it's bar Baroque Entrance, which I'm not going to look at. For the Wither Horde ornament, it looks really good. I still thinking about picking, a, picking this up. The only reason I don't really care about it is because this one already has two ornaments and I like one of them a lot. It's very heavy on hive theme, but this one does look really cool and it is a different color. We'll see, we'll see. For the ghost shell, we have the sweet sprinkle shell, which is really cool. It's basically a donut. And then for the stuff at the bottom, we have the seashell projection. We have sudden squall for the Sturm hand cannon, which it's fine. It's it's cool looking. I just are you going to use Sturm? Uh, we have the Argentate Dusk, which is OK. And then we have the Quadra Cycle, which I am actually thinking about picking this up because it looks really cool. Uh, if you don't have a small sparrow, then this is going to be really, really cool. My only gripe is it's 2500 right dust which is a lot the seashell ghost which yeah and then we have two emotes specifically this one's kind of my favorite because it's just pretty cool so for the other shaders we have the tyran abyss which is from this season so if you don't have this one pick it up it's a really good black blue and purple and white but you know for the other ones, we, Boreal Char. I literally just made a video about this shader. I don't, I don't even remember which video it is. I'll have it here maybe if I remember. But this is a really good black and green shader with hints of uh, like light green. This is a really good shader. I highly suggest you pick this up because, again, uh, I think it was for my Apothesis Veil video. If you don't have this shader, pick it up. I, I it's such a good green. Uh, we have bio loom, which is a blue and green, which I'm not the biggest fan of this shader personally, but again, if you don't have it and it's, it's really good just to have options. Cause you might never know the, there might be a set that just has like turns all of this shader, just black uh, armor set specifically is what I'm talking about. So yeah. And then we have sunrise warrior, which is a pink one. It's a really good pink. I just can never use it just cause I'm, I just can't find anything that that'll look good with it. So that's pretty much it for Eververse. Unfortunately, I was hoping it was going to be the last piece of the armor for this, for this, uh, for the solar armor, but not yet. We'll see. Um, unfortunately, the cloak of backers and the other stuff is not going to be available for bright dust, which is unfortunate because I'm not buying it. The six bucks for, for a cloak is ridiculous for a class item is ridiculous. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, I will have some more fashion for you guys. I'm currently editing fell winters and i think you already saw one of my example sets for the bombardiers but i think yeah that's that's one of the example sets so i totally forgot i had it and i don't want to make redo this video so yeah let me know what you guys think uh, again if you guys want to see certain exotics themed themed videos and whatnot let me know in the comments below I'll definitely get started on that video i do have a racing uh, themed video that I'm still working on specifically the warlocks is giving me a lot of trouble but once I'm done with the warlock I'm definitely gonna make that video as well because I really like themed videos so be safe and I'll see you guys later